G'day you mob, Blackie here, just hearing this crazy noise coming from out back, and looky what we found, <coughs> did, did. by crikey, this one might be a keeper, I've got a little box that this gore, oh he's getting done by a spider, I probably should act quickly, I'm going to act. Going to move this fella into a specifically a specific tank that I've got for creatures of this ilk. So you can get out in there. Praying mantis on a Wednesday night. Who'd have thunk it? Oops. Why don't I just drop the bucket on him? Uh, twice, twice. I'm planning on keeping this guy and I'm going to go and try and murder him on the first night I find him. Shit, he looks murdered. Damn it, he's covered in spider webs, that's the problem. And possibly envenomated by that previous, previous little red spider that was having a go at it. Oh, sorry about the camera angles and whatnot. Might come good. They're pretty good at cleaning themselves. They're uh, like a cat. They'll spend most of their day cleaning themselves instead of eating or sleeping like a normal person. So yeah, I might um, find me a little stick or something to put in here for him. He's certainly not climbing out that glass with those shoes on. You've got socks on, buddy. You've made yourself some socks. Socks of spider webs. Oh my god, this thing is the worst focusing thing ever. <clears throat> so I guess this is my new praying mantis until he gets his socks off and his health back. I'm saying hey because I'm fairly certain that it's only the male praying mantises that have sets of wings like this guy had on display when I first found him. Anyway, I'm going to go and grab a stick or two, a little water jar, and set this guy up. Because realistically at this size, I mean this guy's probably a good four and a half, five inches long. They do tend to only have, based on my experience, I used to keep them in the past uh, 12, 12 months, like one good run through the season, potentially two if they're super lucky, is what I am led to believe a praying mantis lives. So this guy could potentially be at the end of his life. So uh, why not feed him up on cockroaches and grasshoppers? on a regular basis. I've got plenty of them. I know, I'll probably uh, shoot you all the video when I've set this stuff up. Thanks for stopping by. I'll check yours.